Hello Hi. again. <laughs> um, okay, we're just too excited about Books by the Banks, yes, so we had to do three parts. And I um, forgot to tell you something about this Pretty Girl 13 book. So here we go. The character in here. Guess what her name is? Guess what her name is? Angie! And she had these cool little memo pads. It says, I can't remember anything. Angie. <laughs> We say that about Angie all the time. You yeah. can't remember. I'm well, I, keep, <laughs> I, I keep saying that about myself. So, but that that's really cool because Angie is the main character. Right. Perfect. So um, we just kind of wanted to show you some of the goodies that we got while we were there too. Um, back to my that Project Kane book that I was showing you. He did have these where you can scan this and you can actually read excerpts. I think from the book. Um, go ahead and scan that if you'd like on your phone. <laughs> And then there's the cover. And then the other side was Cain's See, Blood. There's See, the boring that's cover. the boring horror novel. But you can scan that code too if you like. Um, oh, see, R.L. Stein. But anyway, he was giving that away, so um, that was cool. And then Angie had. And this one was Laura Bickles, the outside. The one that. Um, um, that yeah, the, this is the, the one sequel Gina to got, the Hollow. The sequel to ones. The hollow. Um, and then this is one I didn't get, but I wanted to because I like the cover. This is actually the exact book cover. It was called The Bubblegum Thief. I don't know, I'm kind of liking these horror, like, thriller suspense novels. And then this is the exact back cover of the book, so that was pretty cool. Um, but I liked it, so that was another thing. Thank okay, you. and this, I didn't get this book, but I want this book, so I got this bookmark, so I could remember to get this book. <laughs> it's by Melissa Landers, and Ooh, it's her, it. um, what do you call them? Dystopian. Oh, yeah. It's a dystopian. We novel. all love dystopian And novels. it came out earlier in the year. Um, but it says it's a perfect blend of sizzling romance, action, and suspense. And it, the cover looks really cool. It does look cool. So. Um, and then my next one is called, um, it, it's part of the Hero Chronicles. Um, it was an author, a YA author, um, that this is his first book. And it's a series of, um, like, natural disasters that are happening. And this kid is, um, like has this power that he never realized he had and um he's writing a whole series and each one is a different natural disaster so it was pretty cool um it was a part of this group called matthew 25 ministries he's the ceo of it so he's seen a lot of natural disasters and experienced a lot of turmoil from those um so and he wrote a lot good. of them they did sound good i, uh, I think the first one was free on kindle it was called um secrets the hero yes. chronicles and then the second one was just 99 cents on Kindle. So it was really cool, but we bought too many books, so I couldn't actually buy the book while I was there. So, yes. um, But Angie has a few more things, and the I'll show you the program kind of and everything. The me over the end. I know. <laughs> um, so I got this. This is Maids of Honor, the, the book that Gina got. And this is the second one that's coming oh, that out called cool. Secrets. <laughs> Secrets. So it, they look, these are such cool bookmarks. I love getting these bookmarks. And then some of the authors have these little, like, business cardy looking things. This is Rebecca Crane. And you'll have to look up what their books are because I honestly don't remember. This is Mindy McGinnis, which is the one book that you have. It's not a drop to drink, right? Yep. This Mindy. is her. And then this was the other book that Blake got. Love Disguise. <laughs> and then this one, I want this girl's book. Playing Nice. Hmm. And it's about two oh, friends. Yeah, Remember, yeah, you yeah, don't yeah, start yeah. out girls, yeah. being friends. They like they're enemies. The author and was pretty cool. Yeah. They end up like becoming really good friends. And oh, then the in twenty fourteen, she has this book coming out. Uh -huh. Looks like a prom thing. So, but this one sounded like it was just a, like a fun read. So I want to read that. There's Blake's other book. <laughs> Scan if you'd like. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> I didn't get these. She did. I know. How come I got all your bookmarks oh, no. and you didn't? And then, oh, this lady was hilarious. Yes. I, she was so funny. And she was this older she lady. She does consignment that, shop mysteries. And like, I guess the they're consignment called cozy shop. Novel, or cozy mysteries. Yes. Cozy mysteries. Cozy. They're like, without the blood and guts, she said. Whereas like, my canes are... Whoa. Project Kane is like blood, guts, and gore. Glory. Hers are more of the cozy, like, coral up by a fire and figure out yeah. who killed who. And she only kills the bad people. <laughs> the evil people, not yes. the good people. The people that deserve it. Right. <laughs> That's what she kept that saying. That is my sense of humor. Which right. cracked me up. So that is hers. 
And I really, I want to read one of her books. I they just, sounded cool. They just sounded really up. girly. So. There were just, like we said there, there were so many books and so little money. So. Yeah, that's true. You now, definitely got to save up for these. So <laughs> you should go next year, if you can at all possible, come to Cincinnati to Books by the Banks. We will be there. Um, this was actually the program that they had while they were there. These are all the panels that were there that day. And then, like, this, the kids' stuff was there. They had a whole kids' section, too. So bring kids. Yes. They um, do balloons and they, face painting. Right. Balloon animals. I had a penguin time. balloon animal made for myself. They have people dressed up like characters. It's sweet. And they, they had all kinds of stuff. Gina went to the one... Um, it was like kids opera. It was weird. It was uh, Cincinnati opera. Let's cook up an opera, and they sang opera. It was I don't know, <laughs> but we went to um, let me see mystery, suspense, and thrillers. The authors were Dan Adriatico or Adriaco Duffy Brown, which is the consignment shop. Yes. Um, Jeffrey Gerard was the Kane's Blood. Anna Lee Huber, I don't remember what she had. And then Natalie Richards, I don't remember that one either. Um, and then Angie went to Paranormal Fiction. Um, Laura Bickle was the one that we saw uh, that she had. Mm -hmm. um, and then we went to... Um, Lynn High Hightower was in there, too. Lynn Hightower. That's the oh. Piper. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how I found um, that. Those are those. And then we went to the YA one over here. Um, YA Fiction in a Flash. There were like 20,000 authors <laughs> on that panel. It took forever for them all there, to answer. There were like, 12 authors it, on that panel. Seriously, it was packed. They all had to like squeeze in together, kind of like we do here. It was nuts, yes. but it was really 12, cool. We should say 12 young adult authors. Yeah, a young adult, right? Yes, they were all YA. I'll, I'll list all these names real quick. Emma Carlson, Bernie, Jamie Blair, uh, Jody Casella, Cindy, Cinda williams Chima, mm -hmm. Liz Coley, that's the one I got, Carrie Corp, Corp, and Lori Glangdon. Those are the, the Dune, Dune authors. Dune authors, we know them. Um, Rebecca Crane, Lisa Klein, Maureen Lips, Lipinski, Lipinski. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mindy McGinnis, which is the one I have, Jennifer McGowan, and Tim Meddy, which Tim Meddy is the guy that did the, um, the natural disaster ones. And yes. then this is the map of all of that, yeah. So it was really sweet. And then all the sponsors on the back. It was yes. so much fun. So you should come next year. It's always in October. Ooh, it's free. And you can go to the website, which is booksbythebanks.org. Books booksbythebanks.org. Books books and I don't know if they have any information up, of course, for next year next yet, year. since it just happened. Oh, this is, the, this is the poster. I don't know if you could see it, but it was pretty cool looking. Yes. Um, they have a contest every year for the poster. But anyway, to the final prize. I think Yay! it would be really cool to give this away. We found a way to do this. Um, but the Greater Cincinnati Calligraphers Guild was there, and they actually do all these calligraphy these fancy writings and we were corrected it is not writing it is an art <laughs> form so they were actually writing out um bookmarks with your name on them and these really cool like texts and like we watched them sit there and like dip it in ink and he made this for us he he did one my first and last name so now you all know who i am um and then another one that was the this woman. was a different this lady uh, another lady did this it was really cool, and this this bookmark says, never judge a book by its movie. <laughs> Wise words. <laughs> I judge a book by its cover, but not by its movie. <laughs> Movies do not typically do the books justice. And of course, I justice. forgot mine. I had one done for me. Angie and had Hannah. one, and Hannah had one. Gina, Gina had one. one. Spencer. Spencer. We all got them. They were really cool looking, and they were doing them for free. And so, we got something for you. We got something for you. So, <laughs> if you would like... A YA Fiction Freaks bookmark in fancy script. <laughs> Let us know why you would want it and what books you would keep it in. Comment on this video. Comment on this video or the that. prior to about this or any of the other books. And let us know that you want this and we will contact you if you are the winner. We don't know how we're going to decide. We will decide though. Yes, so, that has not been determined yet. It has not been determined. But it will. We just kind of decided <laughs> to do this. But um, So anyway, that is our Books by the Banks review and pencils. book haul. Oh my gosh, I forgot. Oh, his Look pencils. at these pencils. I, bought, I see, got all these. you got to come to Books by the Banks. They were free. Look at this. They change color. I don't know if you can see this in the thing, Here, but they're like one of those like... heat-sensitive really? pens, pencils. <sighs> <laughs> ah, crap. It's not working. I can't even show you. Oh, see, you can see a little bit of pink. 
They're, they yeah. change color. How sweet is that? I didn't know they made those. Awesome. So anyway. Really cool for kids. That is our Books by the Banks review. We will see you later. Happy reading. And enjoy these books. If you decide to read them, let us know if you do. Um, and let us know some good books that you hear of. Yeah. So we will see you later. Hopefully we'll see you at Books by the Banks next year. And we will do some book reviews on these when we get through them. All right. Talk to you guys later. Happy reading. Happy reading. Later days. Bye, guys.